Good morning to you, my friends. I'm Cork, and this is Wobble Dogs. I have a couple missions today. Iron Gate, that's fun. So my missions are... Oh, hello, Spud, he's ready to mutate. I want to get... Where's my boy? There's my boy, Crouton. I'm gonna bring him out into the world. I put him away because I didn't want too many things to happen to him while I was off camera. So I want to get Spud to be an adult because I'm going to test something. Hello, Spud, where are you? There you are. Uh, not Spud, Crouton, Crouton. I keep getting this guy's name mixed up. I don't know why. What's wrong with Crouton? That makes it so hard to do. So I want to get Crouton to an adult because I want to test out the theory of feeding a dog core to a dog and making him able to live longer. And I think that Crouton is the perfect test subject for that. So that's what we're going to try to do firstly. Did you get a darker color or is that just me? It kind of looks a little darker. Hmm. Uh, body girth, gloss. Your legs are looking pretty glossy. That's pretty cool. Spud is kind of just staying normal, which is kind of to be expected. The second goal today is to use the simulation and get a dog at 0% stability. <laughs> Cause that's an achievement, first of all, but also I want to see what happens. See if we can get some weird mutations. Just like, I've heard there are some pretty strange things that can happen. I hope nothing too much happened to you. Uh, color stayed the same. That's good. Uh, leg length, leg length, leg length is all going down. That's kind of what I wanted to try and give this guy an easier time in, in existence. Uh, what are you now? You are a juvenile. Proto's an adult. Proto's also, uh, where do you need to go? You need to go this way, right? Nope, that was the wrong way. Uh, I wanted to give him some food. That's fine. You can eat a dog biscuit. How about we do a little simulation? Who should we use though? That's the question. Probably Proto and uh, who else? I guess Spud? Maybe. I mean, I guess let's, well, <laughs> firstly, I'm gonna save again because I don't wanna, don't wanna lose my precious eggs. I don't have tons of them. Let's see what we get. Whoa, this dude's got spots all over him. I guess let's get this dude, uh, this dude, and how about this one? Yeah, let's just do this one, get rid of the pink, and go straight orange. Oh, look at all the spots, that's so cool. All right, we're just gonna keep going until we get to 0%. I don't care if I see, whoa, look at this dog. <laughs> He's so short and his legs are incredibly spindly. That's creepy. But we're gonna go for it. Cause the creepier the better. Ew! I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Oh my goodness. The thing is a little wedge of cheese now. Oh my goodness, that is creepy. Oh my goodness, they're they're so horrifying. Ugh, I don't like it. They're like little bugs. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, well we're just gonna keep going with this. This was the goal. Uh, we're losing the purple. We're going kind of blue. Oh, we're going very blue now. Oh, this, look at this. Look at the size of this dude's head <laughs> in comparison to his body. Yeah, that's what we're going for. And uh, this one, with the bright pink nose. All right, we're just going to do a few speed rounds. We just pick random guys. Keep going. Oh, where did you come from? That's an outlier if I ever saw one. He's got a green body, let's take that. And which one of you is the least creepy? I guess this one. What do we get, what do we get, what do we get? Okay, oh stability is going down. I kinda like this this uh, line of things. So we're gonna go for this guy and this guy. Get a little more of that green color in there. Anything weird happening yet? We're at 51%. Anything at all. Okay, we're gonna keep going with the one big one and one teeny one. Just to keep the spindly legs in there. Maybe get a great big dog with spindly legs? No? Not yet. Okay, we're getting to we're we're getting down there, guys. I want to I want to select this dog who's rolling around away from me. Oh, that's such a cute bark! What a cute doggo. Whoa, only two dogs? Where did that come from? 
Why do I only get two dogs to choose from? Oh man, we lost the spindly legs. Oh, we're at 26%, dude. What's gonna happen? Oh, we lost all the spindly legs. 13%. I was honestly expecting a little bit more from this. Look at the stripes on this dude. He's got some strange patterns. Are we at zero? Oh, we're at zero percent. What does it mean if I go in more? Will it break the egg or something? We're gonna find out. Oh boy, this could be a problem. Oh, seriously unstable. What happened? Did something happen? This guy's got big splotches. Nothing really crazy is happening here. Let's try again, I guess? I guess nothing bad will happen. I'm only getting two dogs. Wait, is it just spitting the same two back out? Oh, we got a couple that time. Oh, it's the same, guys. Nothing's happening. Wow. Well, we got some different colors. <laughs> Look at that dude. He's happy. I think this is the dog for me. This one right here. He's the one. Well, we got it down to 0%. That's pretty cool, honestly. Alright, we got the fertilized egg. What should this little dude be called? I mean, honestly, the more dogs, the better at this point. Because that just means more things that I can uh, unlock. Claim reward, simulated floor. That's kind of strange. I can make my room look like the simulation. Well, let's get that egg incubating, I guess. Boom. Look at the little boy. Buddy. I guess Buddy kind of fits. Oh, he's really short. Uh, Crouton. No, you can't have that name. We're just repeating names. Dog. <laughs> yep. That's the name for you, buddy. Hello, dog. Oh, my. Dog is a feisty one. Oh. Dog do not like be pet. Oh, he's full of personality. Okay. Unpettable. Okay. Let's not pet this boy. Food averse. Doesn't particularly care for food? Aloof. Not very interested in other dogs. Polite. Okay, so he's aloof. Doesn't like to mingle. But he's a polite dog. He's peaceful. Easily forms positive. What? He likes the other dogs, but he hates me. Dog, what's wrong with you? I don't really like this guy. Hmm. Well, we'll raise him. Maybe use him as a dog core. <laughs> it sounds so sad to say that. Hello, Proto. Another capsule? Uh, cubby divider. That's kind of cute. Hey, at least you like to be pet, Proto. Yeah, you're a good boy. Since he doesn't like me to pet him, I can't play with him. Wait, no, that's not the room. To, that's not the way to the playroom. That's this way. There you go. You go play with some toys, make friends, because the other doggos are down here. Since he is peaceful, he kind of wants to, uh, well, I guess he he's polite. I guess he doesn't really want to make friends, since he's aloof. What are we going to feed him? Uh, I wish I could unlock some new foods. Oh, I got, uh, I got a thing. Pet a dog who hates it. <gasps> Inflatable dog. A new toy. We're close to the hatch 10 eggs thing. And that seems like it would be a big goal. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I remember. I was playing off camera and I unlocked a new room. I did. I did. Uh, no, go to build. I unlocked another room. But what do I even do with this one? I don't know. What do I need? Let's put this room down here just for now. I'm going to leave it there. Honestly, I kind of I kind of had ideas about what I should do with a room. But I kind of got rid of that idea because I, I took away the science room and now it's the playroom. What should I do with this extra room? I've got so much space to branch out. Well, this guy's not going to eat too much, which means he's not going to mutate a lot, which is disappointing. I want dogs to mutate. I want my dogs to be strange. Do I have anybody in here who I could take out? These are all the dogs that I care about and I don't want them to go away. Altitude? I could take Altitude out. He's not too old. Hello, Altitude. It's been a little bit. Uh, the more dogs here, the more chance I have of eggs. So, that's kind of what we're going for. Let's try doing Proto and... Well, <laughs> I keep forgetting to save the game. Uh, Proto and Bear. A pretty regular looking dog and a pretty strange looking dog. See if anything weird happens. All I want is... He's got square eyes. That's pretty strange. Let's go with that one. And then... This one. Oh, he's got a really cute little bark there. Alright, we're gonna go with these two doggos. 
Look at this glossy sheen. That's cool. I like the square eyes look. That's kind of fun. Uh, let's go with this guy. And I think this one... Wait, wait, wait. Over here. Yeah, that one. Yeah. Once again, nothing weird is happening. Ugh, I need weird guys. You guys aren't weird enough. Honestly, these dogs are getting kind of large. That could be cool. A really large dog? Maybe we do that? Let's just pick the biggest dogs we can find. Stop pulling him away. I need that dog. Uh, that dog's pretty big too. Big boy? We get a big boy up in here. Oh, look at this color. Where did you come from? See, that's the random mutations we're looking for. But we're looking for random other mutations, like new things. Yeah, that's kind of cool and all, but you guys are still just boring old dogs. That, that guy is bouncing all around. Okay, they're getting a little larger, I think. Maybe that's just my imagination. Uh, did we lose the square eyes? I mean, no, they're still square. They're just round uh, squares. This guy's got the square eyes. Let's take the square eyes one. He's not the largest dog, but he has the square eyes. And I like the square eyes. They're cute. And they're new. All I want is new. Uh, honestly, not going as well as I had anticipated here. I was hoping that we would have a really weird dog by the 0% stability. I don't know how to get these really cool mutations. I saw the trailers. I saw the things that you can do. There's some really cool dogs you can get. I've just got these random dogs that just keep fighting. Crouton, could you please cut it out? That's not a good name. Olive? No. No. Loaf. He kind of looks like a loaf of moldy bread. <laughs> sure. Hello, Loaf. What does he like? He likes to make noise. That's fun. I'm kind of curious. Does a dog have to be an adult to need a dog core? I don't know. Should I wait till he's an adult to feed him the dog core? Because I have a dog core that's saved up from a uh, undisclosed location. I don't know what I'm doing. I just, I want the dogs to be cool and crazy, but it's just not happening. Where is Proto? I feel like I'm doing this wrong because progress is just not happening. Maybe it's hard to mutate dogs. I don't know. Maybe it's tricky. I just, I feel like I need to... I feel like I need to mutate the dogs to do the challenges, but I also need to do the challenges to mutate the dogs because I need to unlock more foods. What can, what can I get? Cramped? Have 10 dogs in the world at once? That just gives me a room. I don't need a room anymore. Loaf isn't changing at all, which is to be expected. It is to be expected. I guess that's the way it should be. Oh, fine. Eat that. Eat that. Whatever. I, do you think I care at this point? I don't care about my dogs. I just want them to be weird. <laughs> That's so horrible to say. Uh, you're sleepy too. Just sleep. You know what, guys? I think I'm gonna have to try and figure things out on my own. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just making random dogs, which is fun and all. But I want mutations. So, I might take some time to just try and figure things out. I don't want to do too much, though, because I want to experience the game with you, my audience. So... I might just, maybe I'll Google some things. Try and figure out the game a little bit better. It's not like there's spoilers or anything. So I might just try and figure out what are the best ways to mutate dogs. But I don't know. We'll, we'll find out in the next episode. And until then, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this episode of Wobble Dogs. If you did, leave a like. And if you haven't already and you would like to, you can subscribe to see more Wobble Dogs and all the other things I post right here on this channel. And as always, guys, in case I don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night.